guys, so welcome to my closet. Today we're doing first episode of the Celebrity Look for Less. Um, we're starting off with Kim Kardashian. I just happened to have a blue pair of jeans and I was browsing through Singer 22 and I saw a picture of her and I'm like, I pretty much have everything she has going on. So I decided to recreate this look for episode one. If you go to my blog, dosakenning.com, which by the way has a whole new layout, which I'm so excited about. You can check out all the pictures, and I also have a side-by-side -side picture of Kim Kardashian, the way she wore it, and the way I'm wearing it as well. So I thought this would be a great idea for me to do because um, a lot of the times I get inspired by a lot of celebrities. The first two things that she's wearing that are really expensive are her leather jacket. She's also wearing J brand uh, blue jeans, which are over $100, and then she has Christian Louboutin boots, which are over $1,000. The first thing that I'm wearing is this white t-shirt. Um, this is from Forever 21 for $7.80. This jacket, I think it was from Forever 21, but it says paper doll on it, so I'm not even sure. But I know this leather jacket was less than $100, and even less than $50 actually. And then I found this scarf at Target, which by the way is a really good material. It's a really nice cotton, and it's super, super warm and thick, and it's also from Target for like $13. Okay, so now moving on to the jeans. I have two pairs of blue jeans. These are actually from BB and they're $100. They're in a size zero, so if you're a 24, they're a really, really good fit. I actually have some also from um, JCPenney, which are blue as well, but the fit is really baggy. So if you're a size 24, don't even bother getting a size zero in the JCPenney pants. Um, because like you see, I don't have a lot of curves. It's just the other ones are really baggy, but these are definitely worth the price so I guess this would be like the investment piece of the outfit and then I also have these boots that I've had for a really long time from Forever 21 and they're like $30 don't know if they sell them anymore but there's a bunch of um, little black boots coming out especially because it's fall so for the handbag I would suggest taking a black one just so you can recreate this look of course you can do it however you want but the one that I have here is from Cotton On and it's just a little kind of like a suitcase bag. It's nice. It's small. It's almost like a clutch as well. Let me show you. So you can pretty much wear it like this. I mean, this thing holds a lot of stuff. It's really small. It also has a chain if you want to hang it next to your side. She's actually wearing a Chanel handbag, but I didn't want to add a Chanel because I feel like this is really edgy. A Chanel is the classic purse, and I feel like it's too feminine for this outfit. All right, so I'm just gonna step back and kind of model the whole outfit. Hopefully you guys can see me. Like Their accessories are kept to a minimal. They either have statement earrings or a statement necklace, or they don't have a lot going on. So for example, she's wearing something so basic like this, and I just absolutely love it. So anyways, hopefully you guys enjoy my first celebrity look for less. Don't forget to check out dulcecounty.com if you want to see actual pictures of the outfit. And on the comment section below, I would love to know which celebrity look you want me to do next. You can either send me a picture on Twitter or you can post it on Facebook. Don't forget to check out my Facebook because I am writing down all of my requests there. So anyways, thank you so much for watching and I will talk to you later. Bye!